We are back with a travel alert as millions book their spring getaways. The State Department has issued a new warning for the Bahamas. Victor Kendo has the story. This morning, a new warning as many Americans seek to trade frigid temperatures and snow for a tropical oasis. The State Department issuing a level two travel advisory for the Bahamas after reports of at least 18 murders in Nassau this year alone. Officials warning that gang crime is happening in both tourist and non-tourist areas, even in broad daylight. The victims, primarily locals. The State Department also urging travelers to be vigilant when staying at short-term vacation rental properties where private security companies do not have a presence. Jason Russell is a college sophomore going to the Bahamas with a group of friends for spring break. We are definitely thinking we should probably stay within the resort. And our parents, obviously, a little concerned with the situation. Stephen Probst just arrived for vacation in the Bahamas yesterday. The Florida native says he'll still take the same precautions like he would for any trip. They don't carry any cash for as little as I could possibly. Um, I don't bring any jewelry with me. I don't bring anything that, uh, no computers or anything. It's basically getting out there and not having something that someone can steal. The travel warnings due to crime stretch across the West Indies, with level two advisories in both the Dominican Republic and Turks and Caicos. Tourists asked to reconsider travel to Jamaica altogether, where there is currently a level three advisory. If you do your homework beforehand and you learn what the problems are and where they are occurring, you can do some things to protect yourself and your family on your vacation. And with this new warning, you might be considering travel insurance, but it can be very tough to use. It has strict limits. Just make sure that you read the fine print before purchasing. Guys, okay, that always read that fine print. Mm -hmm. That's right. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.